Hi everyone and welcome to my time lapse of painting Jack the Westie in soft pastel. If you'd like to learn how to use pastel, be sure to check out the real time tutorials on my YouTube channel, but I also now have a Patreon channel where I go into much more depth in the tutorials and thanks to all those supporting me over there, I'm able to bring you lots more videos like that. So enjoy Jack the Westie and be sure to subscribe here if you'd like to see more. So as always, the first thing I work is the background, and Jack wasn't actually sitting on grass, but some unattractive looking concrete, so I suggested to my client to add a complementary background and all those greens will set the white of his coat off perfectly. While the time lapse gives you a good overview of the entire piece, I've also got a real time video coming soon for YouTube, showing you exactly how I create the grass surroundings. This is something I often have to do as a portrait artist and not just for dogs. Even when you work in a very realistic style like I do, it's good to be able to take the photo reference you're given and make these enhancements to make it so much more than the photo ever could be. Next I begin working on the white dog. And this is something that a lot of artists find difficult, painting white fur. And you really have to save white for the brightest areas and see all those other colours in there to contrast that. It's all about your values. And although I share the exact colours I used in my tutorials, this is really meant to give you ideas and to help you find your own palette and see those values for what they really are. If you get your values right, your colour choices really aren't that important if you get that correct contrast between light and shade. So you can really push colour, be a bit more adventurous with your colour choices. The final touches happen around the paws and bringing that grass up over his toes a little to make him look well planted there. Adding more contrast to the shadows and really giving the dog some weight. So I hope you've enjoyed this speedy look at my process and that you'll visit again soon. Thanks for watching and see you soon.